Podcast, I hope you guys are fans of Rockstar and the last time you Ladies and gentlemen, we gotta talk about GTA 6 immediately, okay? I mean, what the hell just went down today, okay? We gotta talk about the gameplay leaks, we gotta talk about the Lucia Burna, we gotta talk about Trailer 2, when is it coming out? Of course, Take 2 is live streaming very soon, we're gonna get into that topic as well. And there's a bunch of video clips that I wanna share with you in this video. Like the video if you love your mama, like the video if you don't want GTA 6 getting delayed, and you want Trailer 2 this year, dislike the video if you don't want GTA 6 and you want the game getting delayed. I wanna know where you guys at, but apparently you're not gonna believe this, but fans are literally sending drones at Rockstar Games. They're showing up there in person, sending drones, so they can capture some leaks and maybe get a glimpse of Lucia Burna, her OnlyFans, and crap like that. Bruh. You cannot make this up. Shout out to the homie, Zach. Check this out, roll it. The fans of Rockstar are rabid, and I've never seen any fan base more dedicated. Yeah. Wait for it, wait for it. Shout out to the homies, Zach. Talking about how crazy Rockstar Games and GTA fans are, but I think GTA 6 fans are a whole other breed that have evolved from this. So stay tuned because later on in the video, we're going to talk about Mike York some more and some crazy stories he has about GTA fans flying drones outside of the Rockstar Games office to take a look at GTA 5 during the development. But in the meantime, I've seen GTA 6 fans tear apart the GTA 6 trailer down to the last butt hair. Yeah. I've seen GTA 6 fake leaks that are totally crazy and out of this world. But the uh, fact that GTA yeah, fans yeah. are now stopping by Rockstar North's office in Edinburgh. Man, the AI is looking so like, you, you know, all of this is just crazy that we're, we're living in a crazy timeline where the AI can enhance gameplay like this much. The San Andreas, the, the GTA 5, the uh, also GTA the trilogy the defective edition you know what I'm saying uh, uh, you know it has remastered all of that crap with just like that man it, it's insane it's quite uh, uh, insane Scotland and trying to take a look inside that is insane so this all started last week on Twitter when a user by the yeah. name of crazy 65 made this post that's now deleted saying Rockstar games y'all need better blinds and he was outside of Rockstar's office and took a look through the blinds and you can see a graph of some sort as well as an image of maybe a yeah. slideshow featuring that legendary price down font it was yo imagine like this is part of GTA 6 or something right and that got leaked out he got a video off it and there's a bunch of other stuff that is coming up as well but could you imagine, right? Rockstar, y'all suckers, this is your security right now. This is your security. This what y'all suckers be doing right now, of course. And this is gonna, uh, this is gonna make you feel like a di that you're from a dinosaur era because it happened, guys. You're not gonna believe it. Sit down, put your seatbelts on. The first ever GTA 6 leaks happened two years ago. Yes. You know, September of 2022. Oh, shit. And now we are, it's way past two years. It's gonna be a year, one year anniversary since we got the, uh, got to see the official GTA 6 trailer, right? Where the hell is trailer number two? We're gonna get to that one too. Wait for it. It's like a GTA 3 menu. Obviously that's not the case, but that was, there's a comedic value to this, but at the same time, that's pretty wild. And then looking into it, he actually follows me on Twitter. So shout out to crazy 65 for following me. I also seen an a follow up on this post. He said that I was just driving around at 3 a.m. Yeah. with my friends and I happen to be in the same town. We usually climb buildings and do stupid stuff. I'm only 17. So just a young guy and his friends in the middle of the night going around town having fun. They made a great memory. They went viral. So guys, don't be too harsh on them. But it gets even better. So in the past week, another user after this. Shout out to the uh, shout out to the homie, man. He's doing God's work. But can a brother get like maybe like more gameplay stuff? You know what I'm saying? Can a brother perhaps get another leak? I don't want like 90 video type leaks that have back in September of 2022 but maybe like five minutes ten minutes of gameplay leak some somehow some way can a brother get that is that too hard for a, a man to ask for you you feel what I'm saying like the video if you want to see some gameplay too guys this by the name of it. Westa over on TikTok made a video that went semi-viral saying put GTA 6 in, in the, the bag, bag little bro, little bro where he also Brett. stopped by Rockstar's Brett. office and took a look inside and yeah there's a pretty neat mural when you first take a look inside but that's it yo that is crazy so this is this has literally started the trend of people showing up in droves at Rockstar games and some sending like their drones out there which is kind of which is kind of smart dude which is kind of smart Brett. man it's kind of smart I'm not recommending I'm not telling anybody to do it but it's like bruh like what the hell y'all seconds do it man y'all seconds bro listen man this is the the ceo of take two he's like in his 60 60s oh, shit. Oh, shit. and he looks better than most of you guys out there watching this video man damn you guys gotta do 100 push-ups man and before you start doing 100 push-ups you need to get your thumbs game too man 
get your thumbs game up there guys by smashing that like button. No, I'm, <laughs> I'm joking but now nah, that i'm not joking about he's 60 years old and he's looking better than me bruh he's looking better than all of us though guys let's be real maybe not all of us maybe you're a stud muffin maybe you're a chad out there i get that okay whoa i get that but let's be real guys like he's in his 60s man Damn, man, he packing out there, bruh. He packing out there, but this is relevant to the topic. So this is Rockstar Games making a game about stealing shies from people. They're happy, right? This is the same Rockstar when somebody actually steals shies from them, then they start to look like this. I, I, I don't know why. I don't know why they start looking like this, right? But but here's the thing, guys. You don't want to show up there. Uh, but damn, man, suck as we sending their drones out there. That is crazy. So uh, put that the GTA crazy, Six in the bag, little bro. That that's pretty funny. I love that joke. But it gets even better. There's more. A user by the name of Matt, as usual, went after this video and made another viral post on TikTok saying, "Big GTA Six poster in the Rockstar North, North HQ." So this is all in the same location. And in the past week, from the time Westa was there till Matt went there a gta6 poster was put up nothing too i mean of course they, uh, bro of course they're working on this game they revealed it so they're gonna have this as a poster now i'm kind of like skeptical right now guys we gotta talk about this one immediately okay stud muffins rise up stud muffins get along here let's uh, everybody get together on okay, get on we gotta talk about this one here emergency meeting real quick so it is confirmed that yes take two is gonna be doing their investor call on november the 6th 2024 at 4:30 p.m eastern time if you're watching this video after the fact uh yes i'll have a stream on the channel uh if you're if 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 if, yeah, if you're early if it's not november the 6th already a uh, 6th already we're gonna live stream so definitely hit the subscribe bell we're gonna stream absolutely and it is 99 percent sure that they're gonna reveal some kind of information they have been doing that every quarter for the last couple years right yeah so they have been doing that for the last few months as well absolutely they're gonna talk about gta 6 that's for damn sure now last year around this time in november they confirmed that we're gonna get trailer trailer one for gta 6 we're gonna see the lucia burna and in fact we did see the lucia burna in action not not in action but we did see uh the trailer one right we we had the trailer one now people are anticipating and understandably and rightfully so look at that change bruh like so this is the original gta 4 gameplay and you saw the ai which is gonna happen in just uh, again so you, you can see the live comparison as well absolute insane like holy crap the graphics uh, are just uh crazy in this one but people are now anticipating that we're gonna get trailer 2 this year which is very possible i mean that's realistic i mean for the longest amount of time even i have been saying that we gotta get it this year if not well i guess that's gonna be next year it's gonna be, <laughs> it's gonna be next year right but here's the thing though i have also been saying that listen man of course this is assumptions here this is like uh educated guesses right nobody knows when these suckers gonna drop their trailer but if they don't drop the trailer this year then guys don't expect the game dropping in 2025 though already we're hearing that the game is coming out in fall 2025 and they said that multiple times they reassured their investors they buttered their toast and all that which is good which is i okay we love that we love that crap okay we wanna we want reassurances especially when it comes to gta 6 release dates okay because these seconds say one thing and do the complete different okay but already people are even after they have reassured fans people are still skeptical about the release date why because all rockstar's track record they, these seconds always delay their games right it happens multiple times gta 5 red dead redemption 2 right they always have done that uh, so it wouldn't be a shock if they were to but if we don't get the if you don't get the trailer this year then of course not all hope is lost but at that point i would be thinking that yes the game is probably coming out in 2026 though. hopefully not hopefully not we gotta get the trailer to this year because after that we gotta get online trailer gameplay trailers right cinematic shots launch trailer would be at the end for sure story trailer as well right maybe they're gonna have a special trailer for the for for the guy i forgot that's like his name man jason 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 where's jason at yes yeah, so maybe we're gonna get jason's trailer maybe trailer 2 will be jason trailer kind of makes sense right like first they showed us lucia and now they're gonna show jason they showed both but i mean the the trailer was more about hey i am strong i am independent i am lucia i am dad's little princess so that was uh, the first trailer right yeah. now we need to see 
the the brother we need to we need to get brothers uh shot as well in the in the trailer number two we need that man we need that all right let's get back to the content Too special but at the same time it's awesome to see things start to evolve in the rockstar offices we'll touch base on that in a moment of okay. course there's going to be gta 6 art inside it's rockstar but i'm yeah, excited to like, see uh, when we're going to hopefully get the official gta 6 cover I hope that Rockstar does not change things up from the original GTA 6 style created by Stephen Bliss or the original GTA cover style created by Stephen Bliss. I hope that they don't use this GTA 6 Yeah, yeah, I agree, I agree. But I agree. there's another set of videos. These ones are obviously more of a joke. This is from Jake Frads on YouTube where he found GTA 6 at Rockstar Games office. And if we take a look here, he's outside the office. And look, he found GTA 6 on the ground. Bum, this is a bum, funny, bum, ingenious bum, idea. Bum, I love the... That's this. like the Sernando Easter egg right there. Yo, I want like Sernando Easter egg in GTA 6 deadass by Rockstar. Make that happen, sickers! This, th that's awesome. And <laughs> look at that GTA 6 cover. That's what I'm talking about. He also went on to watch the GTA 6 trailer at Rockstar Games office. He's not the only one to do this, but again, the comedic value around GTA 6 fans doing this at this point, you gotta laugh. And that leads me to what I want to talk about next. So Rockstar North has been located at this office in Edinburgh, Scotland Brett, since 2014. Edin, their previous office was just up the road in the same city. And what they do with their games is advertise. This AI is insane. This is, by the way, enhanced by AI. So that's why you're seeing like a real looking person and it's changing every now and then. On the front of the building. At their old office, they had GTA 5 graphs on the front. When it came to this location, they once again did this with Red Dead Redemption 2. And fans have photoshopped GTA 6 on the front and what that would look like but i've got to say in edinburgh scotland this office is located on a public right. street anybody can walk up to it and take <sighs> images or pictures or selfies if i ever happen to be in the area i'm gonna do the same thing yeah, but facts, i hope that facts, it doesn't get facts. to a point where rockstar's gotta like hire security to not let anybody come in front of the building because yeah right it's probably like a couple of bad apples that's gonna ruin it for everybody right because so, yeah some people would be passing by and they know oh shit rockstar they made gta 6 oh shit, oh, yeah shit. let me just uh, get a picture right let me just get a picture real quick and yes uh, that's normal like some people want to take pictures and that's fine though that's cool though but if people are gonna start sending their drones there you know start taking videos from the blinds like the other gentlemen I mean, yes, Rockstar's gonna up the security. Personally, though, can a brother get, like, some GTA 6 leaks, though? Bruh. Like, some gameplay leaks, man. Man, come on, man. Like, f a couple of seconds, okay? A minute or two, maybe, like, ten minutes. Can a brother, perhaps? It's not gonna hurt anything, man. GTA 6 is gonna be a massive game, man. Damn, man. Like the video if you agree, bruh. Because of peeping toms or just getting out of hand. We're in an, a day and age where... Um, you can make viral posts like this, and then it's going to lead to a huge swarm of other people doing this. Doing Whereas the same, in the yeah. past, you might have done this, but it, it didn't have the same effect. It's facts, also not facts, Area facts, 51. Facts. I've got to acknowledge that. You're not going to get a five-star one level for going up here. But once again, I hope that Rockstar doesn't have to put measures for the safety of their employees and just for yeah. the work environment uh, out front by, again, hiring security or something crazy like facts, that. And another cool thing you can do is go to Google Street View, and you can see that before Rockstar North took over this office, the front sign said Scotsman. And then in June 2015, you can actually see that there was construction going on and the sign being installed that says Rockstar North. So from May 4th, May 2014 to June 2015 to then April 2016, you can see then the Rockstar North uh, logo and insignia was added out front. So that's something really neat if you want to check out on Google Street View. So going all the way back to GTA San Andreas that I know of on Canal and Green Street in New York City, Rockstar has advertised their games on the side of this building through murals, which is really neat. So we have San Andreas. There are three renditions Man. for GTA 4, the GTA 4 logo. Yo, GTA, I, I love all the GTA games, but GTA 4 was special because I remember I was like, uh, 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 12 years old when that game came out? Yeah, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. I was 12 years old, and back in the days, we, we would have, like, massive computers. Uh, I'm not sure if any of you remember those CPUs by the name of Pentium 3, Pentium 4, Core 2 Duo, Core 2 Quad. Yes, that might be gibberish to a lot of you out there, but if you're, if you're a boomer, if you're an OG, right? <laughs> you probably know what I'm talking about, man. Like, I remember the, you to be able to connect to the internet, uh, I'm in Montreal, right? So we have the Bell Internet. Now I'm not no longer with them. Like, those are like, just crazy, man. They would always charge you every, more every single month. We had those issues. So we were like, get mama, man. We ain't, we don't want to do business with you guys. But back in the days, around 2008, right? Like, I, I was uh, with, uh, we were linked with Bell, so the internet service provider. And you would need, like, a DVD. You would need to put that DVD in your computer, install, like, a software. Yeah. To be able to connect to the internet, it's like... 
Yeah, right? Like, it was cool, crazy. Now you just, like, turn on Wi-Fi, turn off Wi-Fi. Bruh. Bruh. Y yeah, right? Like, crazy Yo, times. Lola, right? the lollipop cover. And, and yeah, as a 12-year-old playing and seeing that, uh, that, uh, you know what I'm saying? It, it was kind of crazy. It was kind of crazy. The graphics felt like real life to my my console peasant eyes back in the days, for Girl. sure. And the Nico Wanted poster. Nico they bin. also advertised episodes from Liberty City, yep. Chinatown Wars, and GTA 5. China and just like one. at the Rockstar North headquarters, fans have photoshopped what GTA 6 could look like on the side of this building. So yeah. I'm excited to see Rockstar start rolling out the advertising for GTA 6 in due time on their own time. It might be taking place more next year than this year, obviously. But they also do this in Los Santos or real life Los Angeles at the Hotel Figueroa. And I, listen, I try to do my homework on pronunciation because y'all will just annihilate me in the comments. But at this hotel, going all the way back to GTA 4, Rockstars advertise that. Episodes from Liberty City, Chinatown Wars, GTA 5. And in GTA 5, this location is called the Hookah Palace. And it appears. So pretty cool stuff there. And once Hold again, up. fans have photoshopped what GTA like 6 would look like, like, like on this hookah. building. And I just can't wait to like see that. Rockstar do this. That's when you know things are going to be getting very real. I believe they yes, did it with sir. GTA yes, 5 sir. like two or three months before it released. I want to show you guys this clip as well. Okay, so this is towards the end. Had a, uh, a drum or my monitor through the window. You could probably. So this is uh, uh, the ex GTA Rockstar dev talking here. You see me or my monitor through the window if you were like had a uh, a drone or you were like mm -hmm. at a certain angle and you're looking you could probably see it right and so that's a big and I, so i immediately went over and like closed the blinds and did everything you know and i realized eh, i thought geez that's really like trying to be wow i can't even and then like a month later or something like that a couple months later there was a drone caught flying outside of our building and, and we were pretty sure that they were trying to look inside the windows of the building to see what we were working on Guys, check out this video on the screen. This is the last episode that we've done. We had a ton of GTA 6 leaks in this one as well. Some gameplay leaks as well. I'm sure you guys are going to like this one. Check this out. If you've already seen it, then check out the video on the left.